You know, in the early 2000s, all we had were injectables. All we had was Botox from 2002 was FDA approved, and then from 2004 we had our first fillers. And so a lot of my patients have been with me since that time and got very used to getting Botox and fillers every few months over and over. And um, what happened in, you know, the last 10 years is there's been this revolution of wonderful new laser treatments that we do here at the Miami Skin Institute. And uh, they have skin tightening, skin lifting, muscle lifting, great body contouring, all kinds of different things. But, but let's focus on the face. Um, a lot of my, my older patients who've been here a long time, they, they don't believe the laser is going to help them as much as the injectables. And so I tell them they need to get out of that mindset. They need to get out of their Botox box where they're kind of stuck thinking that Botox and fillers are the best and only way to preserve their youth. The truth of the matter is, is that as you get older, as you get over, you know, in your mid forties to early fifties, um, if you don't do these lasers, what you'll end up doing is getting more and more Botox and more and more filler. You'll need more, or you know, you won't get the results you used to get in your 30s and 40s. And then what happens is you start looking weird. You see all these patients who run around the city um, with their eyebrows too high, you know, looking surprised. They're, you know, they've got the joker smile, or their lips are too big, or just all kinds of things that don't look very natural. And what I find is if you, if I want to keep someone looking natural into their 50s and 60s and even beyond, a combination of Botox. So we do the same amount of Botox and filler perhaps that they did in their 30s and 40s, but we add laser onto it. And then that preserves the dosing of the Botox so that you can stay low so that you still don't look weird, but your skin is tightened and refreshed and you still look young without looking different. The other reason a lot of people won't come out of the Botox box is because Botox is a quick fix, right? Filler is a quick fix. They look wonderful right away. Um, it's an instant gratification. And the lasers, you look, you look better, you know, right away because of the swelling a little, you know, for the most part. And then, you know, it takes two to three weeks to see results. The results are subtle. Skin tightening, the tightening of your skin is always a more subtle look than your wrinkles disappearing, right? So most people don't really see the value in the lasers, but the value of the lasers play out over months and years and decades because they reduce your Botox needs and costs, they keep you looking natural, and they actually address the issues that are happening in your 40s, 50s, and beyond by tightening the skin and lifting sagging tissue. So they do a lot more and a lot of different things than, than Botox and fillers. And while I don't advocate one over the other, I definitely recommend that everybody who can do combination treatments with both modalities, injectables and laser, for their best possible results, you know, well into old age.